Mary Hans, Miss Cheap is in the studio with us this week. We have so many good things to talk about for free things to do to celebrate Black History Month. Well, the Nashville Public Library just has a full calendar, and one of the things that I think is the best is their Ellingtown. You know, they do the puppet shows um, on Fridays and Saturdays in the library downtown, and we've been to some of those, but they also take the show on the road through this puppet truck. I didn't and, know there was a truck. Well, it's great, and they do all kind of different productions, but, you know, they make their own puppets at the at the library. Um, it, it's beautiful, but Ellingtown is going to be at different libraries every Saturday this month as part of Black History Month, mm -hmm. and it is, it's, it's just one of the, my favorites of all their shows. And this is uh, Duke Ellington. Right, and it's done with the, with the, jazz, uh, the jazz group, and it's, it's, it, it's a, joint process, a, a joint project that has turned into something that I think is a work of art and totally entertaining. All right, let's take a listen. Well, hello. way to introduce kids to jazz music. Well, it is, you know, the, the library, they say that the reason they do the puppet shows is to introduce, you know, children to literature, mm -hmm. and this introduces them to music, and it's really not just for kids. I mean, I think adults will enjoy this just as much. Mm -hmm. The Nashville Jazz Workshop really was the one that promoted it, and then the library took it on, but it's, it's really great. What a terrific idea. This presentation that we're looking at right now actually took place in the library, but it also happens in the puppet truck that goes all around the city during the month of February. Right, and it's got 26 puppets in it. They're mostly rod puppets. Uh, the whole thing lasts about 25 minutes. Um, but I think people will really enjoy it um, and learn a lot about jazz music at the same time. So when can we see this one? Well, it's, it's every Saturday this month, and it's at two branches each time. So it, it just rotates around. So you can look at library.nashville.org and see where it's going to be when. Nice. What other things does the library have going on? Well, one of the things that I've also seen and just been really impressed with is uh, Dennis Boggs does a portrayal of Abraham Lincoln. And he's going to do that at one of the libraries this month. And Dennis Boggs is, I mean, he has it down. He looks like Abraham Lincoln. He talks like Abraham Lincoln and does like a first person kind of um, show on that. Um, and then, then there's also the Burr Rabbit productions. Uh, these are performances uh, by the actor Michael Diallo uh, McClendon, and he's a, he's a really great actor, and he takes some of the Burr Rabbit tales, the Uncle Remus tales, and, and does those. It's great. Great. So again, we can go to the Nashville uh, Library website to find out about times and, and where those performances are going to be. And there's lots be. more on the calendar. Their, their calendar really is chock full of things for Black History Month. Okay, and then Super Bowl is coming up this weekend. That is Sunday, and it's half price. Uh, it's the only time all year they go half price, and their rates are going up March 1st, so this would be a good time to check out the zoo, and um, if the weather's great, you know, you'll see a lot of animals, and some of the animals are even more active in winter than they are in, in summer. So It's a great time to go. Time to go. Mary, thanks so much. Thanks. Stay cheap. All right.